What is going on guys, Mikey Games here and welcome back to a, another video. My gosh, it's been a while since I've given that intro. Uh, I mean, a long, long while. <laughs> How rude. That car was very rude. How dare it go past? Who do you think you are driving on the road? <laughs> Anyway, guys, we are here playing Dark Confusion, a Minecraft horror map that was created by JCT0115. Oh, according to Minecraft Maps, in his description, this is the first time he's made a horror map. So, we will be kind. <laughs> rules. Let's not start with the rules. Let's start with the warning first. The warning is, this map will confuse your mind. This map contains loud and shocking jump scares. Cheating and changing the map game modes is only for a week. I'm going to guess that's supposed to be for a weakling. I don't know. Uh... <laughs> Nevertheless, changing the game modes is only for a week. Everywhere you go is dark. Are you afraid of the dark? We'll soon find out when we face your fears. Rules. Don't change the game mode. Don't break anything in this map. Set your volume to 100%. Nothing more, nothing less, 100%. Play for your right game version. Well, the website said uh, for Minecraft version 1.19, he says here for 1.19 plus, so anything above 1.19 I'm guessing would work. At the moment we are on Minecraft 1.19. Click the button to start your adventure. Make sure you're ready before you start. I'm going to guess so, I'm in my dark coloured pants today. <laughs> we are ready for the horrors of a jump scare. Shall we begin? Dark Confusion by JCT0115 And we are in a room with blindness and slowness. And we have a redstone torch because that is not in the slightest bit ominous. And the journey begins when you open the door. Blimey, that is dark. <laughs> Lovely! Oh, is it going to be one of these maps where you walk round the corner? And all of a sudden it's blocked off and you've got to turn back and go the other way. Oh, yes it is. I like these maps. They're very well done. <laughs> I wonder what we're going to come across as we walk around these halls. What jump scares are going to lurk around these corners? I mean, so far we haven't had anything apart from dead ends. And changing bag. <laughs> oh, a door. Hello? Something's going to jump out from one of, behind one of these doors, I know it. Hey! <laughs> he proved me right. He dropped by to say hello. Isn't that jolly kind of him? And up the stairs we go. Alrighty. Uh, uh, oh, hello. Back to the redstone torch. Let's go this way. <laughs> Back up the stairs again we go. Ooh. We're back on the left turns again, peoples. Here we go round. Ah, uh, no. Ah, <laughs> uh, no. Well, that's different. What happened to the stairs? We've got a ladder now. Okay, let's go up it. Come to one more door. I wonder where Hero Brian is. Is he going to show himself? Because apparently he's here somewhere. We've had a skelly bone. What else is going to jump out at us? <laughs> there he was. <laughs> The end. Thanks for playing. Well, thank you for making the map. If you didn't make the map, I wouldn't have been able to play it. And thank you for watching at home. If you enjoyed it, 
don't forget to leave it a big old thumbs up it really does help if you do want to give this map a go for yourself i will be leaving a link in the description down below but as for the map's gameplay itself for a first time map i thought that was really good what i would have done done is perhaps i would have changed out the white wall for a light gray or perhaps a dark colored wall just so it uh, encompasses the blindness effect a little bit further um yeah it was good the blindness did help but having the sights of the walls around you as well as what's in front of you it's uh it did break the immersion a little bit but having that sort of tunneled vision with a darker surroundings that doesn't reflect so much light that might that might help just to keep the horrors of it alive i mean at the moment, I think, from what I can see, there's nothing, no bright lights in here. I mean, it might be because there's no lights in here whatsoever. That there is actually made out of white wool. But I think this is this looks dark. This does look dark. So it might be stone actually. <laughs> <laughs> but yeah, now I've gone for a grey material. Anyway, guys, that's it from me for now. Until next time, take care. Bye for now. <laughs>